always get excited when it comes to a little bit of DIY here on Expresso Show because it's nice to show you that DIY can be hassle-free, it should be easy, but most of all, it should be fun. So today I'm with our builder's DIY expert, Mr. Aidan Bennett, to show us how to make your own doormat because nothing says welcome than your very own personalized doormat. Now, dude, nice to see you, man. Morning, morning, morning. Nice to have you back. So what are we going to need for our little project? A wood saw, natural fiber string, a pencil, pine wood, varnish and wood stain. Also sandpaper, an NT cutter, measuring tape and drill. Let's get started. To kick off, we're going to measure a length of 500 millimeters. Just mm -hmm. mark it with a pencil there. All right, that's obviously going to be the size of your doormat. And then we're going to hold it over the side here. Yeah? I need those biceps of yours. <laughs> Once we've got that one piece, from the one side, we're going to measure 100 mils. Okay. And make a mark there. And then we do the same on the other side. Just measure off at 100. The next step is actually drill through the, the crosses that we made with the pencil. Okay. This is, uh, so we can thread our hairs in through. Then sand down the wood so it's nice and smooth. Measure out the other nine pieces, cut them up, drill holes and sand. And that makes 10 pieces. There we go. Well, they clean up pretty well, don't they? Eh? They do, they're beautiful. The next step is to stain them, and then we're gonna string them together with the hair and twine. Now, because we've got the clear wood varnish, what we're gonna do is add this oak stain, and there's nothing fancy here. You can just literally pour it into the container, and then give it a good stir. Brilliant. That should do the trick. And that's all that's left to do now, is start painting. Yes, sir. You may paint the wood pieces with any color of your choice, like dark walnut or cherry, whatever meets your fancy. All right, Aiden, so we finished all our wood pieces. They look absolutely beautiful. I think they're ready to become that doormat now. They're going to be taking the big step up. <laughs> Promoting them. We're going to cut two rough lengths of the Hessian twine, and then on the one side, we're going to tie a nice double knot. OK. We're going to thread it through. As you can see, just thread it through. And you just snip off the excess, and there she is. Good. Done. It's the absolute thing of beauty. Absolutely, I love it. Now, of course, you can personalize this to your own taste, right? Quite right. I mean, there's a variety of stains you could use. You can also customize the size to match your own door size. And uh, if you wanted to get really creative, you could actually make a stencil. You can also take the measurements on our website to builders, and they can cut everything to size. Then you simply have to sand down, stain, and then join the pieces to make your very own doormat. DIY is easy and it's fun, it shouldn't be hard. Get down to your local builder's warehouse, get everything you need. We'll also put everything you need on our website, expressoshow.com. Check it out. And who would have ever thought that it could be that easy to make your own doormat? So if you're feeling very inspired and you want to try that out, you might want to stand a chance to win your very own 250 Rand Builders voucher. All you need to do is SMS the word Builders, including your name and city, to 33728. Now, home improvement giant Builders, in association with Pro Sport International, is presenting South Africa's favorite sports quiz. Now, the first in the series of the events took place at a packed out uh, venue in Durban this month and is now making its way to Cape Town and Johannesburg to test your your sporting knowledge against the wit of quizmaster Dan Nickel while rubbing shoulders with some of the biggest names in South African sport. Now there are fantastic prizes up for grabs courtesy of Megastar, Bosch and Eurolux. Now um, if you'd like to book your table, uh, of course the event in Cape Town is taking place at Grand West on the 28th of August and the Johannesburg Leg is taking place at Empress Palace on the 2nd of October. You can follow at ProSportINT and at BuildersFan on Twitter to be the first to hear how you can book your table. Now stay with us, want na die breek is graan nog steeds in Duitsland en hy het 'n bietjie Duitse woord geproe en hey, hou daarvan, lekker.